Welcome to Elliott Wave Analysis and Forex Forecast. My name is Mohammed Azim and I am a certified Elliott Wave Analyst. This video is brought to you by ReadyForex.com. Risk disclaimer Press the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to never miss upcoming videos. Today is Monday, October 2nd, 2023. I am going to analyze NZD CAD currency pair. Let us start the top to bottom Elliott Wave analysis. Inside daily time frame, the trend is up in NZD versus Canadian dollar currency pair. Daily time frame support is present at 0 0.7904 price level. Price action is most likely going to rise up to print bullish wave C zigzag corrective leg in coming trading days. A decisive bearish break below 0 0.7904 support area is going to end up trend in daily chart of NZD CAD currency pair. Next, let us take a look at 4 hour time frame. Price action is printing higher swing highs and higher swing lows. To me, NZD CAD pair trend looks up in 4 hour time frame. Next, let us take a look at 1 hour time frame. The trend is up in 1 hour chart intraday support is present at 0 0.8084 price level. Price action is most likely going to drop to print bearish wave 4 pullback. After that, I expect bullish wave 5 impulse leg which offers a chance to join an uptrend in NZD CAD pair. A decisive bearish break below 0 0.8084 support level is going to end up trend in 1 hour chart of New Zealand dollar versus Canadian dollar currency pair. To be more specific, the green color highlighted area offers a buying opportunity which is the previous fourth wave of one lesser degree. Take note, you must always trade with money management rules to control risk. Hello traders, today is Friday, September 29th, 2023. Currently, I am holding a sell trade in spot silver. Right now, spot silver is falling down. The Elliott Wave trading strategy works with multiple currency pairs and trading instruments. And right now, I am holding a sell in spot silver. Now, let me go down to a smaller time frame, like a five minutes chart. And it seems to me we got one, two, three, four, probably going down to print five. Okay, it seems to me market is trying to finish the wave number five over here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to first lower down my top. You know, I want to lock in some pips. You know, this is called trade management. Once you are in profit, you do not want to give back the profit. You want to protect your trading capital from a potential loss. So now to me, this is a free trade. I cannot lose this trade. However, today is Friday, you know, so weekend is approaching. So let me go down further in a one minute time frame. Okay, it seems to me market is trying to create some kind of a bottom pattern over here. So I think it is a good idea to look for an exit. Let's see if I could uh, get few pips down over here. Okay, I am now going to close this trade. Let me hit the close button. The trade is now closed. Let me now show you the trading account history. So this is the trade right over here, closed in spot silver. Let me show you my trading account statement. Let me save this as save as detailed report. This is my Forex trading account statement and today is September 29th. Let me scroll it down. You can see all the past closed trades over here. And here is the last trade which I just closed in spot silver with a profit. Let me scroll it down further. Here is my equity curve and it is moving up. For those who are interested to learn Forex trading, just visit my website readyforex.com. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me. For more Forex trading information, visit readyforex.com.